Journey's Lesson 21 Informational Text, Wagons of the Old West, by Maria Santos, illustrated by Dan Britty. One of the oldest kinds of transportation is the wagon. It is a four-wheeled vehicle drawn by strong animals. People around the world have driven wagons for thousands of years. Wagons on the Oregon Trail in the United States, wagons made history between the 1830s and the 1860s. During this time, thousands of pioneers traveled westward. Some went as far, far as Oregon, but others settled in many places along the way. The pioneers journeyed for up to six months to reach the West Coast. They had to pack a lot of food and supplies for the trip. Families packed some of their furniture, too. To protect their possessions and supplies from the sun and the rain, they used covered wagons. Back east, there was an enormous wagon known as the Conestoga Wagon. Its rear wheels were as tall as a man. The top rose to more than 11 feet above the ground. The back and front of the wagon bed were sloped upwards so that cargo would not tip out when traveling across mountains. People liked the design of the Conestoga, but these wagons were too heavy for the long journey west. They needed as many as six or eight horses to pull them. The wagons would have to travel over very rough land as there were no roads yet. A smaller wagon was built with high sloped ends to keep its cargo from spilling out. It also had a white canvas cover to protect the cargo from sun and rain. Traveling in groups or trains, Across the flat land of the prairies with their white tops, the wagons sometimes looked like ships. People soon called them prairie schooners, as a schooner was a type of ship with white sails. Wagons on Prairie Farms Once the pioneers chose the place to settle, they built houses to sleep in and to store their food. They no longer needed to carry such heavy loads. The prairie schooners were much too big for everyday use. Pioneers needed a wagon that was comfortable to ride on. Much smaller farm wagons were built. Springs were added so that riders would not feel all of the bumps along the trails. A spring is a steel brace that holds up the bed of a wagon. The springs were lighter than the heavy frame of a prairie schooner so the wagon could travel faster.